In this video, we just want to look in particular at the differentiation of, of hyperbolic functions. Uh, and we know that, that um, cosh x is, is, can be written in terms of the exponentials at half upon e dx plus e to the minus x. Uh, and when we differentiate that, when we differentiate half e to the x, uh, we just get half uh, e to the x. But when we differentiate uh, e to the minus x, we get minus e to the minus x. And so uh, when we differ differentiate this overall, we actually get half e to the x minus e to the minus x, which we know is shine x. So when we differentiate cosh x, we get shine x. And similarly, if you uh, look at uh, differentiate shine x in terms of the exponentials, then uh, we actually go back to cosh x. So that's unlike uh, trigonometry where we differentiate uh, sine to get cos, but we differentiate cos to get minus sine. Um, in uh, hyperbolic functions, cosh differentiates to give shine and shine differentiates to give cosh. And it can be shown to you, and we'll, we'll see this uh, in a wee minute, that when we differentiate tanch, we get shek squared. Um, using the, the, the uh, exponential, we can also differentiate cosh ax. Uh, and when we do that, we see that we get a shine ax. And so this is like we're using the chain rule um, for, for sine ax or cos ax. It, it works in the same way. So when we differentiate shine ax, we get a cosh ax. Um, and likewise, if we were to differentiate tanch ax, we'd get a differential, differential of ax times the differential of tanch, which is shek squared ax. So for differentiation, uh, we can use all the same sort of rules as we did for differentiation of, of trig functions. We can use the product rule, the quotient rule, the chain rule. So let's look, as I said, at, at how to differentiate tan checks. Uh, and really, if we, we, we uh, change this, this is the differential of um, a quotient. So uh, shine x over cosh x. Uh, and again, you know, if we say that, that u in that quotient is uh, shine x then u dash is cosh x we know that when we differentiate shine we get cosh and likewise v is the bottom of the fraction the denominator cosh x so v dash is when we differentiate cosh we get shine x so when we put this in uh, v du by dx well v du by dx is just cosh squared x minus u dv by dx and that gives me sinh squared x or shine squared x and on the bottom then we have v squared which it turns out is cosh squared x now we know that cosh squared x minus shine squared x is, is one of our identities that's equal to one so we've got one over cosh squared x which by definition is check squared x and so there's that, that proof of the one we, we just uh, saw on the previous page uh, likewise, we can uh, differentiate cos x with respect to x uh, by writing that as um, d by dx of, again, a, a quotient. That's cos x over uh, shine x. And again, when we, we uh, do v du by dx by u dv by dx, this time we get uh, shine squared x minus cos squared x. And that's all divided by, in this case, shine squared x. Uh, so if cosh squared minus shine squared is 1, then shine squared minus cosh squared is minus 1. That's minus 1 over uh, shine squared x, which is minus cosh squared x. So again, we can use uh, the, the, the uh, quotient rule to help us differentiate these. Um, moving on, uh, we can use similar... Uh, methods as, as we do with, with uh, trigonometry to, to differentiate uh, shek and koshek. You know, if we think of uh, uh, shek here as d by dx of, well that's um, cosh x to the power of minus one. Shek is one over cosh. Uh, and so if we differentiate that using the, the chain rule, then that's going to become minus one times uh, cosh x to the power of negative two multiplied by the differential of cosh x. Um, now when we get a differential cosh x, we know that we get shine x. And so that ends up then as, as uh, minus uh, shine x over cosh squared x. Or we can write that as uh, minus uh, tanch x 
shine over Kosh is Tanch uh, times one over Kosh X, which is Shek X. Same sort of thing for, for uh, differentiating Koshek. We can say that, well, that's the differential of um, uh, shine X to the power of negative one. Our chain rule, so multiply through by the power minus uh, reduce the power by one. So it's shine X to the power of negative two. And then multiply by the differential of shine X, which is cosh X. So it's the same sort of thing here. We get minus cosh X over uh, shine squared X. And we can leave it like that. Or um, we want to, to write that as, as a minus cosh X. So one over shine X times uh, cos x. So in these examples, again, similar kind of things. Uh, so when we differentiate uh, tan squared x, we know that we're going to get two uh, tan x times the, the differential of, of uh, what we get when we differentiate tan x. Um, so that is uh, two tan x. And as we've already seen, when we differentiate tan x, we get shek squared x. And so because we know that, we can go straight to, to that. We don't need to go through the, the rigmarole of, of differentiate tan x again. Um, something like this uh, bottom one then, when we're uh, differentiating, uh, again, there's, there's a function of a function involved in here. Uh, first thing first, uh, when we differentiate cosh to the power of 5, we're going to get a 5 cosh 3x. So uh, overall, we're getting 15 cosh to the power of 4, 3x. And then we need to multiply that by what we get when we differentiate cosh 3x. Uh, so that's 15 cosh to the power of 4 of 3x. When we differentiate cosh 3x, again, that's a chain rule or a function of a function, we're going to get 3 shine 3x. And so putting that all together, then we get 45 cosh to the power of 4, 3x, shine 3x. So three final examples here. Again, involving exponentials, logs, and, and uh, quotient. Uh, this first one, nice and easy. When we, we differentiate an exp exponential, it stays the same. So it's going to stay as uh, e to the power of uh, shine 2x. But we've got to multiply through by the differential of, of shine 2x which in this case is two cosh two x, job done. Uh, I know when I differentiate a log, then we get, uh, it's in the form of f dashed of x over uh, f of x. Well, the log of our function here is cosh x, so that's cosh x. And when we differentiate uh, cosh x, we get shine x. Um, so shine x over cosh x, and actually we know that that is tan x. So when we differentiate the log of cosh x, we get tan x. And the final one then, uh, again, a uh, uh, quotient rule. Uh, so let's define our functions here. u is cosh 2x. So u dash is at 2 shine 2x. Uh, v in this case is at 1 plus x to the power of a half, or the square root of it. And so v dash is equal to a half of 1 plus x to the power of minus a half, multiplied by the differential of 1 plus x, which is just 1. So it's uh, okay in this case. So when we put this in v du by dx is at 1 plus x to the power of a half uh, times uh, 2 shine 2x minus uh, u dv by dx. So it's minus a half upon 1 plus x to the minus a half times the cosh of 2x. And that's all over then uh, cosh, sorry, um, 1 plus x to the power of a half all squared, which is 1 plus x. Uh, we can uh, cancel this down a wee bit. Uh, I'm just going to take out a factor of, uh, in this case, um, let's take out a factor of a half. And let's take out a factor of 1 plus x to the minus a half. And that leaves us then with, uh, on top, uh, we've got a 4 uh, upon 1 plus x upon shine 2x 
and that's take away plus 2x. And the denominator then is going to be 1 plus x. And that does simplify down a wee bit then. Uh, as on top then we've got 4 upon 1 plus x upon shine 2x minus cosh 2x. And that's all over um, 2 and 1 plus x to the power of not just 1 but the minus a half as well. So that's 3 over 2. And so we can differentiate there. Again, there are various different ways of once we've got to this stage of factorizing the top or uh, re reducing the, the, the denominator as well. So, uh, but essentially, it works exactly the same way uh, as uh, normal differentiation. And once we know how to differentiate cosh and shine, um, it works almost exactly the same way as, as trigonometric differentiation.